Hello everybody, we're back for another episode of Rhythm Doctor, and I think today we're probably going to be able to finish off Act 2 today, so let's just get straight into it. Intermission 2-4, Song of the Sea. The Colt Ting. The cafe is available for all staff during the workday. Feel free to relax and spend time with our in-house barista. Want a drink? Come and sit for a while. Okay. Welcome. Take a seat. Uh, you're probably just sitting already. The rush hour is over, so things should be a little more low-key. Make yourself comfortable. There's a dusty keyboard over there. Maybe you can toy around with it. Oh, look who it is. Ooh, I can actually play the keyboard. Hey, I'll get my usual. The morning usual or afternoon usual? Afternoon. I'm just vibing for now. Coming right up. You at the intern finger too, huh? Wild. Yeah, I was just talking about you earlier, actually. Really? Yeah, I was talking about how great the stuff on your band cloud is. Whoa, for real? Nah, you're lying. Yeah, I'm lying. I've got a job already. Can't be your pass out my mixtapes person. Sure you can. We're at that level of friendship, right? Almost. Keep working at it, bud. you skip them in line. Secret safe with me. Thanks. I know it's in a hospital, but is it weird to like the vibe in here? You like it here? Yeah, it's got atmosphere, you know? Haha, <laughs> whatever you say. Aside from doctors, I'm used to serving hipster loners in here. I can help maintain your pristine natural habitat. Hey. Just kidding. Well, not really. I like the song. What is it? I mean, it doesn't really have a name. Just an old file I still put on sometimes. This is you! That's you on guitar? Yeah, this is from a while ago. I used to dabble. Whoa, that's awesome! I didn't realize that you're a musician. <laughs> I'm not sure I'd call myself that. I just strum around. But still, this is great. It sets the mood. Barely even remember making this. It's like my younger self is here, keeping me company with her guitar. Maybe that's why I keep it in rotation. To keep myself company. Makes sense to me, I get that. You know, you mentioned something yesterday, that you need a coffee to write music. Why is that? This is actually last. There's actually a lot of dialogue here. I don't know. Sometimes I can't come up with ideas. Other times I just get in my own head. Like, maybe I accidentally stole this chord progression from something I already heard. I get 
wrapped in that. It's frustrating. But when I drink coffee, it helps me stop thinking about that stuff. I can stay up late, so late that I can't even think straight. Then finally, I can write music. Well, glad I can help then. All finished? Yeah, I should probably head to my room. See you around, Nicole. Thanks for the shot. Later. S plus. Good job. Okay. <laughs> You are now the cafe's in-house musician. Wow, I did not expect that, actually. Uh, okay. Is this a chill level? So, that's two of our main SVT patients having episodes in one day, and both relapsed into the very habits causing it. So much for self-control. To be fair, you can't just kick a habit overnight. We should check in on them one more time before our shift is over. Ian, you go find Nicole, the intern and I will check on the barista. <laughs> Alright. Hey guys, what's up? Just checking in. How are you feeling? Okay, for now. My shift's almost over. I don't take it anymore. Just smoke breaks. But it's tough. Hard to say numb during work. Coffee people are so impatient. Have you been able to take your mind off of it? Does anything help? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Actually, the red hooded guy sent me a song he made once, and now the song's stuck in my head. So in a way, I guess that earworm, earworm, sort of helps time go by. Honestly, if every customer could be more like that dude, each day would be a lot easier. <laughs> What's wrong? My chest not feeling great. It'll be okay. The intern will help. Are you ready? Stay focused on the beat, no matter what. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, so this is the actual boss stage. Does this have a nighttime level? God damn. This would be so out of place to play this level right now, if I just decide to play it randomly. But you know what? I feel like we kind of have to, just to go along with the flow, so let's go with it. All the times. Cold Brew, Nicole Tang, the musician and barista are experiencing a heightened SVT episode. Keep steady with your two-beat treatment no matter what. My mind is spinning. Would it be crazy to walk up and say something? Oh god, okay. I think is th I think this is connect for a Bordis again, right? It has to be, because it's the glitchy screen again, so... Okay, I I I'm really... Oh, what? Uh... Um, is this supposed to happen? Well, I guess we'll, we'll, we'll just go along with it. If this is a weird glitch, then uh, it's going to be really unfortunate. Boss stage. All right, here we go. All right, let's see how Get ridiculous this gets. Go! I just can't refrain. This virus has a lot more HP. Oh, wait. Oh my god. The screen is actually moving. Oh god. Oh my god.
again. Hey, where did he go? Right. Like the field water board. What do you have for me? Oh, it's faster. Win? I don't know if I lost. Please. Act two complete. Oh my god. Wow. Dude, that level. I cannot believe they really did that. Oh my god. That song is insane. Oh my god. What? Oh, I honestly, I'm even more hyped for this game now. What an interesting concept for Connect to Board is to always be in every single boss stage. Um, wow, I don't even know what to even say for that level because that was that was just good. <laughs> oh, it looks like my let me fix this real quick. There you go. Ooh, that was crazy. I thought my heart was gonna jump out of my chest. Same. <laughs> you were able to treat them both at once. Perfect. Oh, the doc is here. Guess I probably gotta go back to my room. <laughs> but uh, maybe I could hang out here just a little longer while Nicole closes up. I could whip up something to care for him, promise. Fair enough. You're not in trouble or anything. Why do I sound like a school teacher? You know, Doc, I don't think you guys should worry about me. That thing you said, about finding inspiration to keep music in music. I think I can do it, without the caffeine. That's great news. Habits are tough to change, but having someone to cheer you on always helps. <laughs> I'm here. Finally, Cole. There's, there you are. Oh yeah, I kinda gave him the slip, huh? You alright, Ian? Uh, yeah, I was running as fast as I could to tell you that if a virus connected to Abortus was detected again, this time, and Cole and the barista. I was rushing to find you, but, uh, it looks like you already handled it. Good job, I guess. Very punctual. Anyway, these two seem to be feeling much better. We'll check out on them tomorrow. Whenever you're ready, let's head back to the main ward. Okay. Let's do it right now. So there you go. Nice. This, this is... I still like this level so much. It is so tricky, but... Ooh... Connective uh, board has just made things like a hundred times harder. All right, let's play the nighttime level of this. Song of the Sea Night. Nicole Ting. The cafe is available for all staff during the workday. All sorts of folks tend to come by. Want to unwind again? Maybe you can play for us. All right, let's do it. I'm assuming that, is it gonna be another chill level? Maybe. <laughs> Well, look who it is. Welcome back. Make yourself comfortable. We still have that dusty keyboard. Why don't you play it for us? Alright. I'm closing up soon, so things should be chill around here. Alright, ready to play the keyboard again? Oh, here comes a familiar face. Hey, Nicole. Hey, Doc. Dr. Page, right? You can call me Ada. Alright, Ada. What are you having? I'll 
just take my usual small cappuccino, thanks. Coming right up. Is that the intern? Yeah, they're interning for me now. My known house pianist. Hope you don't mind. Multi-talented, huh? Don't take this the wrong way, but you look terrible. What? Exhausted. I mean, you look exhausted. Oh, ha. Well, what else is new? Is it really that hard? Because that's probably a stupid question. No such thing as a stupid question. But, I mean, yeah, it just... A lot of running around. Most of the individual things I need to do for patients are pretty by the book. Or at least, they used to be, before the whole rhythm death thing. Now everything's weird and we constantly improvise. But that's just the job. As long as it helps people, that's what matters. Here's your coffee. Thank you. So music can heal people's hearts, huh? Could be the head doctor around here. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I pursued the wrong degree after all. Could have saved myself a lot of schooling if I'd known we only needed music in a single button. Maybe it bags under your eyes seem to say my job is a lot more than pressing a button. It's complicated. There's still a lot of work to do. Like what? Well, after the treatment we gave you, did you still feel the urge for a cigarette? Basically, yeah. But just felt better, but it didn't completely change everything. Still got a pick up pack on me, actually. Exactly. So the rhythm treatment isn't a magical cure all. Addiction, therapy, rehabilitation. Rehabilitation? It's all complicated. It's gradual. Healing is slow, and habits are hard. Maybe someday the rhythm doctor method will be improved to handle those things. Until that day, you're all still stuck with little old me. Making the rounds, checking in on you, scribbling on the clipboards. Well, good thing you're a delight, then. I'd miss seeing you around here. You've always got an eye out for us. I like it. Ah, thanks. Hopefully Dr. Etika feels the same way. Back to work. See you later, Nicole. Thanks for the chat. Anytime. S plus. Good right, job. Cool. Employee benefit. Discounted coffee. All right, there you go. Nice. So, uh, I'm assuming that, yep, there you go. We've basically finished everything in act two, which is finally, I mean, it took like, it took a while, man. These SVT patients were a lot more difficult, and I imagine that I'm, it's not going to be the last time I ever see of them. But damn, this boss level right here is so good, and I'm just I'm just even more excited of what the third act is going to contain. I imagine that this is probably the point of the game where it's going to get really really challenging for me. So 
I'm definitely gonna need to up up my rhythm, you know? Keep noticing the cues and keep a steady rhythm. But I guess that's all for me. See you guys in Act 3.